Hi guys, um, I'm in my MailChimp account and I'm going to show you how to clean out some email addresses that are pretty useless to you, um, especially if you're paying for an account. So <coughs> there's no point sending out emails to people that don't open them and stuff like that. So I've got, I'm in my list section here. So I've, I started off at the dashboard and now I've pressed on lists up the top here. And now I'm going to go and choose a list and press on view list. Okay, so here I am and I want to view all. Okay, now here's my list here and you see how it's got um, three stars and five stars. This person's fantastic because he opens all my emails. Um, yeah, I've got some five star ones here three stars okay, four stars are good. Right, so what I want to do is just say there's any two stars or one star, I want to get rid of them. Now I'm not really sure whether I've got any, but I'm going to show you how to find them. So what we're going to do is we're going to press segment. So that means we're going to segment the list. Now um, in here, we're going to choose all, okay? That's one of the most important things here is to choose all because I'm actually going to put a couple of conditions onto this so I can segment it nicely. Now in here we're going to choose member rating, okay? And we're going to go to the next box and choose is less than, okay? And now we're going to just scroll along here or whatever and choose three. So any member with a rating of less than three. And then I'm going to add another condition here. And I also want to find out any member that joined up right before right a spe specific date. So I'm going to choose the date. Because I don't want to delete my new members um, that haven't had a chance to have a look at an email yet or an open an email. So what I want to do is make sure I'm getting the old members. So what I'm going to do is choose a date. So we're going to go back a couple of months. So we'll go to August the 1st, say. Okay, so these people would have been added to the list before August the 1st okay and they must also have a member rating of less than three now they must um, fit both these conditions okay not just any we want them to fit both of them so what I'm going to do now is press view segment okay so I've got two people in that category right so one of them is a one right so that means they've never opened an email from me and this one here is basically, yeah, they've never opened an email either. Uh, they, yeah, basically that's what it means. And here it is here. Um, they signed up in July. And this one, yeah, they're both in July. And they've never opened an email. So I'm going to um, delete them. I'm not sending them emails anymore. Why should I? Right. So just say I had a really huge list here and I wanted to select them all, I'd go up here and I'd say select visible and it'd select them all there. Okay. Now after that, if I wanted to delete them all at once, I'd press on this drop down thing here and say delete or unsubscribe, either way. Okay, so let's just press unsubscribe and it'll say hold your horses, are you sure you want to do this? And you say confirm. Now those people will be gone. Okay, now obviously if I press view segment now, there'd be none, no listings in here because I only had two and I just deleted them. Okay, so let's see if we go a month the other way, September. We'll see if there's anyone that, you know, signed up in August or whatever. And so we'll press view segment. Okay, there's one. Okay, now... Um, it's a list rating of two. Now what I'm going to do is quickly just open this link in another tab. It tells you about the member rating. I'm just going to show you so you're not worried about it. A one star is a negative rating. This person has 
um, unsubscribed and resubscribed or soft bounced in the past. Number two, the star, star two is no activity, never opened, never clicked. Star three is this um, recipient has started opening or clicking your campaigns, limited activity. So obviously you've got to give these three star people a chance but this is why you've got to go in and if they turn into a two star or a one star I definitely think you should get rid of them because um, when you um, get into big subscriber lists and stuff it costs a lot of money to actually um, you know send emails out to these people you know like legitimately so anyway I'm going to delete that person and say goodbye to them um, because it's only one person I can just go over to the right here and press delete okay and it says are you sure and I'm, oh yeah I'm sure yep alright that's it now it's taken me back to my email list so you just got to be really careful that you don't delete any of these good people that you know are trying to open your emails and stuff just this is really really a dangerous thing to do when you've worked really hard to build up your list um, you just got to be really careful when you're deleting them alright thanks for watching okay guys if you're watching this video on YouTube make sure you come up here where it says subscribe and press on the subscribe button here um, that'll let you know when we've got all new videos and stuff like that also you can go um, in here and have a look at all more videos if you like there's heaps there's 211 so far you might find something you like just scroll along and um, you'll be able to see and also um, if you're on my website already and you're watching this video you should um, put your email address and name in there and subscribe to our newsletter uh, because I give away like free reports and stuff like that and they're not just any old thing they're, they're written by me and um, they have some really good tips and tricks in there about building websites or you know computer tips or whichever one alright thanks for watching